bulbs are cute little creatures until they start digging up your plants and start eating your bulbs. And that's when you call in Jim Pease from ISU to get some advice. So Jim, tell us more about these little guys. Well, you've got two different critters in the yard usually. You've got the eastern chipmunk, which has just a couple of stripes, uh, light stripes in the back, or the 13 line ground squirrel. Now these are really different critters. This guy tends to be a woodland or woodland edge critter, whereas this one tends to be a critter of open country, often called the squinny or grinny. They both live in underground burrows, but the chipmunk will actually climb trees as well. Uh, these guys are strictly uh, ground dwelling critters. Lots of people like to watch them and they're fun to have around, except uh, when you have one is fine, but when you have <laughs> this many in your yard, it can be a little bit of a yeah, problem. Yeah, exactly. Now, how do you get rid of them? Well, uh, there are a couple of things you can do. Number one, if you feed birds in the summertime, uh, you might stop feeding the large seeds, the, the sunflower, the safflower, the, the, the peanut seeds, and stick with just the, uh, the small ones. Uh, that way they're not having all of their friends and neighbors uh, and, and come in, and they're having smaller families, so it's a, a, a good thing to, to do that. You can also use some repellents. They're effective on select plants at uh, specific times, or you can use trapping, live trapping, using peanut butter as a bait, moving them uh, Oh, several miles away, or snap trapping with uh, a rat sized snap trap and peanut butter as a bait. All right, so trapping is the best option, you think? I think that's probably often the case. All right, thanks. And if you'd like more information on chipmunks, be sure to log on to gardeninginthezone.com. I'm Liz Gelman.